In this video, I will bleed the brakes in a 2016 Toyota Tacoma with the TRD off-road package. The brake bleed procedure is a little different from normal. You have to turn on the key and use the ABS system, but you don't need special tools. Grab four bottles for free and get some 3 16th inch inside diameter vinyl hose. Before you open the cap, wipe off the reservoir so you don't accidentally get dirt inside. If the brake fluid is dirty, use a syringe to suck all the brake fluid out and refill it. This step is very important. Turn the key on, but leave the engine off. The ABS system in this truck won't let you bleed the rear brakes while the key is off. Jam a pry bar between the brake pedal and the seat to hold the pedal. Start at the right rear brake. Open the bleeder. You'll hear noise from the ABS pump. The anti-lock brake system notices the rear brake fluid pressure is too low because you have the bleeder open, so it activates the pump to move fluid to the rear brakes. It will bleed the brake for you. Bleed the brake until you see clean fluid coming out and no air bubbles. Close the bleeder screw. The ABS pump will stop. Refill the brake fluid between each step. If you let it run dry, you'll get air into the ABS system and it will be very hard to get it back out. Don't worry about the fluid level, just fill it to the top. The key should still be on with the engine off. Open the bleeder screw for the left rear brake. The ABS will make some noise and brake fluid will come out. Keep the bleeder open until you see clean fluid with no air bubbles. Close the bleeder screw. The rear brake bleed is done. Remove the pry bar from the brake pedal and turn the key off. The rest of the brake bleed procedure is normal. Top off the brake fluid again. Open the brake bleeder on the right front brake caliper. With the key off, slowly pump the brake pedal all the way to the floor and let it come all the way back up. Pump it 7 to 10 times, then hold the brake pedal down by jamming the pry bar between the brake pedal and the seat. Holding it down on the last pump will prevent the brake system from sucking an air bubble back up into the caliper. Close the bleeder screw. Refill the brake fluid again. Now open the bleeder screw for the left front caliper. The key is still off. Slowly pump the pedal 7 to 10 times and jam it down with the pry bar on the last pump. Close the bleeder screw. The brake bleed is complete. Refill the brake fluid to the max line. Check all four bleeder screws to make sure they are tight. Spray the brake with alcohol or water with dish soap to clean up any brake fluid you might have spilled. When you're done bleeding the brakes, you should have a nice, firm pedal. If it's soft or the pedal goes too low after a few pumps, bleed the brakes again.